favorite dinosaurs. So this is Calbasaurus. What does he do? Is he a carnivore or an herbivore? A carnivore. Now my next one. Now my next one, and down the sweat. What does he do? That's so cool. Awesome. What do you next? What does he do? Is he an herbivore? Nope, he's a carnivore. Even in Dominus Rex is a carnivore. Okay. Tyrannosaurus Rex. Mmm. But these are dinosaurs from Jurassic World. T Rex okay. can open his mouth and close it. Is now what is he? He is a carnivore and he is Tyrannosaurus so Rex. Real quick, buddy, what do they call the um? What do they call the carnivores that walk on the back two legs? I don't. I don't know. It starts with a th. The theropod. Theropod. So T Rex is a theropod. Okay. Now, next dinosaur is the most dangerous dinosaur of all, Indoraptor. Oh man, he looks he looks sinister. Yeah, cause he cause he is dangerous. Yeah, what makes him dangerous? He is so threatening. He is black. He has a yellow stripe going down him. He has little feathers on his arms and on his back and on his head. Mm. Is and he really smart? Yep, he can run really fast. He has a long tail. What does that long tail help for? Running really fast. Yes. Excellent. Now this huge one is Brachiosaurus. Oh he my is gosh. the most Brachiosaurus is the most huge dinosaur. I thought it was a Patasaurus or or Argentinosaurus. Am I wrong? Yep, but it's Brachiosaurus. Okay. And it can open its mouth. His teeth look kind of sharp. Is he a carnivore? Nope, he's a herbivore. That's why he has sharp teeth. He for grinding plants. Okay. He's big. Yep. He can stomp on edibles, so he can stomp on carnivores mm. when they attack. So this is Allosaurus. It can bite and move its arms. His body is like T-Rex. Is he also that T-H word? Yeah, but he's not T-Rex. He's Allosaurus because of these things on his head. Okay, but is he um, is he a quadruped? Nope, he's a carnivore. What kind of carnivore? A theropod. There you go. Nope. Now the next one, <clears throat> and now the next one is Baryonyx. Baryonyx. It can chomp, and Baryonyx is a carnivore. What does he eat? Meat. Well, he has a very interesting jaw shape. What kind of meat does he like to eat? Just regular meat. He doesn't like fish? Oh, yeah. He, he eats fish. What are those claws for? It's for grabbing things and killing fish. Oh, okay. So he can eat fish. Now the next one. Now the next one. Now the next one, so the next time, so is Ceratosaurus. Ceratosaurus. He can bite with his arms. Mm. Ceratosaurus has this little brown horn on his snout. Mm. And is he also like the other two two-legged meat eaters? Yep, he's a carnivore. And a? Cool. And he's a theropod. There you go. What? Okay, so if that's a theropod, 
What kind of dinosaur is Brachiosaurus? He is a quadruped. Well, kind of, but he's a really big one with a long neck, and they're called... It starts with an S. So do. Sore? Sauropod. Sauropod. The, the big long necks are sauropods. Okay, the next dinosaur is Sycamimus. Sycamimus. It can, it can bite, move its tail forward and get, uh, not forward, but it can move its tail, bite. He looks, in his mouth, he looks a lot like Baryonyx. Does that mean he eats? He eats fish too, but he's Sycamimus. Okay, he looks scary. Yep, because he is a carnivore. He eats meat. And he eats fish. Now the next one is Spinosaurus. Oh, he's my favorite. Even its sister's favorite dinosaur. It can open its mouth for me. Now, is he bigger than T-Rex? Yep. Even he's bigger, even he's bigger than Gigantosaurus. Wow. And he eats fish. Okay. Now the next one is Velociraptor. Oh yeah. And he doesn't. And he and Velociraptors aren't black and have a like and have a yellow stripe down them like the Indoraptor. Velociraptors are just regular raptors. So wait a sec. And the Indoraptors are not regular raptors. What kind of raptors are they? So, still. They're, are they a mix of some things? No. So, the Indoraptor and Velociraptor are carnivores. They eat meat. Is an Indoraptor a high? Yep. What is it? A hybrid. What's a hybrid? A new dinosaur. They make like one dinosaur out of two different dinosaurs. Yeah, Indoraptor is a hybrid. Oh, okay. Oh, and Indoraptor and Velociraptor are carnivores. So Indoraptor and Velociraptor jump on people and then eat the people. Do they hunt it alone or do they hunt in a pack? They hunt in packs, but not Indoraptor. Okay, he's a lone ranger. Kind yeah. of like a T-Rex. Yeah. So T-Rex and the Indoraptor and Dominus Rex and all those others hunt in no packs. But Velociraptors hunt in packs. And they slash. Okay. So the next one is Ankylosaurus. Oh. It can, it can move its head. Um, it can twist its head, move its tail this way. Okay, and then let me ask you this then. That's a lot different than our other dinosaurs. What kind of dinosaur is that? A herbivore. And then he walks on how many legs? Four legs. So that makes him a? Quadruped. There you go. So Ankylosaurus is a quadruped. Very cool. I'm uh, even he's a uh, the next one is Stegosaurus. Wowie. Look at those spikes. He can move its tail, move, twist its head. What are those spikes for? They're for protection. Okay. And the plates are for, and the plates on the back are even for protection from carnivores. I heard a rumor. What? I heard that they thought that maybe the plates were to help keep their body temperatures up, that they absorbed sunlight. Do you think that yep. that's true? Yep, that's true. And wait a sec. How many yes. legs does he walk on? Four legs. So he's a? Hobo. And he's a quadruped. Gotcha. The next, the next one. The next one is Sauropelta. Sauropelta. He kind of looks like uh, Ankylosaurus. Yeah, but but he's not. He's Sauropelta because of these giant spikes on his back. How cool. And little spikes on his back. Interesting. And then he can, nope, he can do this. Mm. So Sauropelta is a horrible and he walks on 
full legs and he's a quadruped. Excellent. That's good to know. The Who's next, next? The next one is Pachycephalosaurus. Oh, he is cool. He can cup its head right into that hole and you push this button and look what happens. That's cool. So what does he do with his dome head? What's that for? It's for head butting animals. Oh, okay. Like, do they fight over things, or is it kind of like a, uh, like a contest, or? No, it's not a contest. Still playing. Oh, okay. They're like practicing. Mhm. Still playing. So, and they walk on two legs. But they're not a, uh, they're not a carnivore, are they? Yep, they're herbivores. Okay, the two-legged herbivore. Yeah. Interesting. Who's next? So, the next one is Ornithlestis. What is it again? Ornithlestis. Ornithlestis. And it can move its head. Oh, how cool. And open its jaw. Close its jaw. Now, let me ask you a question. What? Is that one of the oldest dinosaurs or one of the newest dinosaurs? The newest dinosaurs. Are you sure he's not one of the oldest? Oh, he's the oldest dinosaur. How many fossils have they ever found of Ornithlestes? The tail and the legs and the body and the arms and the head and the neck. I read that they only ever found one fossil of Ornithlestes. Oh. It's not for us. He said for us and for us. So I think that that's kind of a guess about what he looks like. What do you think? Yeah. Like an educated guess? Yeah. But the next one is Gallimimus. Gallimimus. Tell me something cool about Gallimimus. He runs really fast, like the Velociraptor and Indoraptor and only for this. Now, what does he eat? Plants. And, the, and when he runs, he knocks down people. Oh. Because they're really fast. He's just so speedy. Mm -hmm. Do you suppose he ever came in contact with a person? Yep, he, he would run by a person and then knock the person down. So were they alive at the same time as people? Yep. Oh, no. Nope. Nope. There you go. They were millions of years apart. The next one is Metrocatosaurus. Mm. It can wall and close its jaw and open its jaw. Oh, he's cool. Tell me about Metrocanthosaurus. Well, Metrocanthosaurus is a quadruped, and Metro and Metrocanthosaurus is a carnivore. He's a quadruped? Yeah, and he's a carnivore. How many legs does he walk on? Two. So he's a quadruped. Quadrupeds walk on four. Oh, so he's a. What is it again? Is it a th? Thelbon. Yeah. Metro Kansas, which is a theropod instead of quadruped. What's next? Who's next? There's so many dinos. Next one is Sills in the source. Whoa! Look at those claws. Yep. He used those long claws for killing other carnivores, but but did you know those in the source can open its mouth, move its arms and it can actually open its mouth and even those in the sources are herbivores so they so they eat plants that's cool and those in the source are one of the so old. he looks yeah he looks super fierce but he eats plants yep interesting but let's, he's one of the oldest see. herbivores yeah let's see his oh yeah look he has like a beak Interesting. All right. And the next one is Triceratops. Oh, classic. Triceratops. Oh, how cool. Triceratops can roll and move its neck. That's cool. What's that frill for on his head? It's for a shield. Oh, very cool. And he's a quadruped. Oh, no, please. Yep. You're right. Right on the money. What does he eat? Plants. So he's a whole bull and quadruped. Very cool. And he uses these three horns to protect themselves from carnivores. Mm. Who's next? 
next one is Montesaurus. The next one is Montesaurus. Edmontosaurus. That sounds like a city or a, an area called Edmonton. Is that right? Is that where they found him? Yep. Okay. So, a Montesaurus is a quadruped because he eats plants and he walks on four legs. He looks like he walks on two, maybe like a half and halfer? Yep, because he is a quadruped that eats plants and walks on four legs. Okay. Look at his, look at his hands. Yep, his hands are these. Interesting. All right. So the next dinosaur is is the Lophosaurus. Whoa, wee! What does he do? He spits acid. Interesting. Look at those frills. Yep. He he. So he hides them, and then when he spits acid, he just gets them out. Interesting. He looks dangerous and scary. Yep, because he spits acid. Mm, okay. When he spits acid, he lifts his ears up and then spit acid. Interesting. <laughs> He's kind of scary. What does he eat? He eats me and, and his little frills on his thing. And, he, and these are all his ears. Are you sure they're his ears? Yep. All right. What's next? The next one is why. Um, the next one is Cryolophosaurus. What is it? Cryolophosaurus. Cryolophosaurus. Yep. Tell me he, about him. He is so. Con so. Quilophosaurus walks on two legs and he eats meat. So he's a? He is a... Nitha... Nithopod. Theropod, there you go. Theropod, because theropod. Now the next one is really huge. Okay. Oh my gosh. The Mosasaurus is a huge big sea creature that lives in the sea. No. He can open his mouth Whoa. and close his mouth. And he can jump out of the ocean and grab fish. Interesting. Or even he can grab a shark when he jumps out of the ocean and grabs a fish or shark. That's wild. He well, looks totally ferocious. He knows the source. So is he a dinosaur? Nope, he's a sea creature and he's a carnivore. And he has this big jaw for grinding up little teeny big food that humans eat. So, um, so he's like a marine reptile. Yeah, he's a more mean, so, yep, he's a more mean reptile. Very cool. Okay. He's huge. He is well. huge. Put him on your pile. Goodness. Now, the other one. Now, the next one is Dimetrodon. Dimetrodon. He's an older one, too, huh? He walks on four legs and he has spine on his, on his back and he eats meat. Mm. So, you know what he reminds me of? What? Like an iguana. With, yeah. with, a, with no sail. Yeah, but he's not. He's a dimetrodon. A dimetrodon is a theropod. Mm. Uh, he walks on four legs. Yep. He walks on four legs, but he's a carnivore with a spring on his back and with a short, long tail. Okay. Who's next? The next dinosaur is... Stitchy Moloch. He's so cool. He can bump his head. Oh, wow. He kind of looks like Pachycephalosaurus. Are they related? Are they like cousins, maybe? Yep. So Stitchy Moloch is a, is a head-butting dinosaur. And what does he eat? Flats. Hmm. And, he, and he walks on two legs. 
Very cool. Who's next? The next one is... Are you even close to the bottom of that thing yet? Next one is Dimorphodon. Dimorphodon. He can fly in the sky. He can really fly in the sky. He's a yeah. he's a really good flyer. Dimorphodon has a short like tail, and he has and he has a leaf on his tail. When he flies, he can make it glide and fly. Is that right? Who's next? What does he eat? Meat. What kind of meat? Uh, he eats fish. Okay. Next one is Tapiera. Tapiera. Oh, let me get a close-up of that one. He's cool. He can fly, too. Oh, how? what a wacky face. He's cool. Even he can open his mouth. Even he can open his mouth. What does he eat? Fish. Very cool. Tapiera is pretty cool. Who's next? The next one is... Minmi. Who is that? Minmi. Minmi. He looks like an Ankylosaurus too. Yep, but he's Minmi. He doesn't have a club on his tail. Okay. But he has spikes on his back. That's why he's called Minmi. He doesn't have a, a club on his tail, but he has spikes on his back. So he's called Minmi. Um, what does he eat? Flats. And he walks in how many legs? Four legs. So he is a? One, two, three, four. He's a quadruped. Oh, okay. Who's next? The next one is, is, is Parasaurolophus. Parasaurolophus. What does he do with that thing on his head? He makes people fall asleep and he makes noises with it. He makes people fall asleep. Yeah, with it, because he's a Parasaurolophus. Okay. What does he eat? Rats. And he walks. And he walks on two legs. Mm. And he has a long tail, but he has a long foot tail. So, the next dinosaur is... Who's next? The next one is a reptile, and it's called... Rampharynchus. Rampharynchus. He's he, cool. He can open its mouth. He looks like a fish eater too, is that right? Mm -hmm. But he can open his mouth even he eats fish. See, he can open his mouth. Oh, okay. Whoa, he can open it really wide. And he can close it too. Those are some pretty scary teeth. Yep, but he can fly in the sky with his wings. And he even has a lift on him so he can make it just um, swing around in the sky. Oh. That's like. He does wings. Who's next? I'm excited to see who's next. The next one is Godzilla. Who is that? My Godzilla. Let me see him. He's cool. I want to see Godzilla. Godzilla? He's cool. He's not a dinosaur, but he's pretty cool. Tell me about Godzilla. He is a monster. Yeah. Godzilla has plates all around his back. He has a long tail. Where'd you get that Godzilla? From Christmas. Who got it for you? Um, you don't remember? Yeah. You got that one from Sissy. Oh. She knew you loved Godzilla. Oh. She was so excited. He has a long tail. Who else did you get? Do you have another monster in there that's not a dinosaur? Let me see. Yep. And it is... And it is Winter Godzilla. Winter Godzilla. Did you get a couple of Godzillas? Yep, I got three. Where's uh, King Kong? Oh, he's right there. You can easily see him. So, Winter Godzilla lives in Christmas. Okay. And, and, when, and when you see Marshmallow Godzilla and you see these, and you, and you see these, and you think it's 
Marshmallow Godzilla, while he has black around his white spikes, so he, everybody can know he's Winter Godzilla instead of Marshmallow Godzilla. Mm. Who's and next? Next show me, show me the King Kong. Sissy got, she saw those for you for Christmas and she had to get you King Kong and Godzilla. She knew you loved them. So, this is King Kong. Very cool. He can, he can punch out of people. Cause he is a really, really mean monkey. <laughs> King Kong is a really mean monkey gorilla. Mm. When he walks on two legs, he can smash people. Mm. Alrighty. And the next monster is Born and Godzilla, and you can fix his tail. Who is this? Born and Godzilla. Burning Godzilla. Yeah, we'll have to get the tail back on him. Yeah. It's kind of tricky. That's okay, buddy. I'll take care of it. Yes. I'll take it. Thank you. Who's next? The next one is Draco Rex. Who? Draco Rex. Draco Rex. Draco Rex is a dinosaur. Oh, how cool! He's nice. Tell me about Draco Rex. Show him. Show him. Draco show Rex. Draco Rex has huge, really horns on his head. Okay. A lot. And he eats plants and he walks on two legs. He eats plants? Yeah, and he He's walks. called Draco Rex and he eats plants. That's pretty cool. And He's he walks, pretty fierce he herbivore. And he walks on two legs. Mm. Um, does he walk on two legs? Yep, he walks on two legs. Now the next one is... Pteranodon. Ooh, Pteranodon. What's Pteranodon got? A fish. A fish. Very cool. Because he can swoop down and eat the fish. Cool. Who's next? Are you getting close? Just bugs and they all Just bugs and all those are all your dinos? Yep. Awesome. Even, well. I, even I don't have a Camp Cretaceous Parcel Office and I want that for the next Christmas. Okay. Well, can you tell your friends thanks for hanging and, and we'll see you next time? Mm -hmm. Bye. See you next time.